<laughs> up late, up late with G Williams. Up late, up late with G Williams. He's smart, he's cool, he's funny. He's smart, he's cool, he's funny. Funny. Laughter, one way to the heart. Comedy and jokes, another form of art. I like to do interview and funny, silly skits. I like to support my people before they get rich. People say you couldn't make it. I said, why? If I fell and don't make it, at least I tried. So I started me a show to support my city, to promote your talent while I act silly. Tell a lot of jokes and just be me. It's a message behind it. I hope you can see through humor. Bring you more closer to me can't be nobody else man i gotta be g up late up late with g williams up late up late with g williams he's smart he's cool he's funny he's smart he's cool he's funny funny laughter one way to the heart laughter one way to the heart i said laughter one way to the heart <laughs> What's up, y'all? Welcome to the Up Late Night Show with your boy G. Williams. What's going on out there? I'm glad y'all up late. Thanks, man, for supporting me, man, and, and watching the show, man. I'm going to dive right in about a lot of issues that I got going around the world, man. But first, I want to talk about the cable company. <laughs> Ain't y'all tired of y'all bills going up and down? I am. Every time I keep calling, Someone's always on the phone that don't speak English. They keep saying, Greg Audio, please give me your information. I'm like, man, I ain't going to keep doing this. Pitch one for this, two for that, three for that. Man, so much, man. Sometimes I want to just cut it off. But then if you cut it off, then your girl going to be mad because she coming home like, boy, why we ain't got the cable on? Because I don't want to keep going through all that foolishness with the cable people. Man, it's just crazy out here dealing with bills and life and everything, man. I just appreciate y'all, man, for checking out the show, man. We're going to have a lot of funny skits. We got a lot of stuff going on tonight. So I hope you come back, stay up, and don't go to sleep. We be right back, right after these messages. Art inspires creativity. And that creativity leads to worlds being built. And lives change. Hi, my name is Greg, and I believe that influencing our community can start with our children. I have written these books to influence our children using story coloring books that will open their minds to all possibilities and lessons of life. So not only are they coloring and flexing their artistic muscles, but they're also learning and reading about moral principles that will get them through life. So, to order and to support me in my mission to serve our community, purchase the coloring books at Amazon.com. Just like me! Woo! Hey there, pretty lady. Hi. Hello, how are you? I'm actually doing very well. And yourself? Good, 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 good. Uh... What was your name? Elena Renee. Mm. <laughs> Elena Renee. <laughs> why do you say it like that? It sounds, uh. Is it French? Okay, yes. Oh, okay, I guess not. You, you, well, you look nice. Well, thank you. Oh, where you headed to? Um, 
So, up late with G. Williams? Okay, all so. right, all right. Yeah, G's a good guy. He's a he's a real good friend of mine. Super dope. Eyes yeah, on the, you I just, just want... I, okay. it's, it's so hard not to look at you. Well, um, well, thank you. No, no problem at all. I so, feel the uh, same way about your shirt. It's, uh, it's oh, so, oh, so we gonna go there. No, you look <laughs> nice. You look tropically. I like that. I like that. Are you related to little Kim, maybe? Just a little? What is that? What? Nothing. Um... <laughs> I can't take my eyes off of you. I'm not even. Gonna Could lie you to focus, you. bro? I'm just like, gonna what? keep driving. That's what I'm gonna do. Man. That's what I'm gonna do. Cause really, you really just cool. Thank you. You really on the scale from one to ten by the four. What is, what is that smell in here? Uh, you should probably stop breathing. No, I think it's your feet. Do you have on socks? No. no. Why <laughs> does that matter if I got on socks or not? I smell toes. Uh, it's not. That's not toe. That's bunion. Okay. Bun. Ain't nothing wrong with a little bun. Can this thing go any faster? Um, I just really want to get there. It's a classic. Yes, it is. Don't mess it up. Okay. You so shiny back there. You all in my, my, my rear view, and you're throwing off everything with that. <laughs> is that aluminum foil on your bag? Uh, yes, sir. What, it's whatever you need it to be. Okay. Well, we almost there, so you Thank ain't you. gonna have to have that little, uh, distraction in my car. No, I have enough distractions in okay. this car. All right. Did I compliment your, uh, high heel tennis shoes that you have on? No, but I appreciate it. Thank you so no, much. those are really cool. Do you like Charlie and the Charlie Factory? What does that have to do with anything? What because your shoes look like the golden ticket. <laughs> <laughs> right here, you're gonna go ahead and uh, exit out of wow, my well, vehicle. Ungrate. Okay. I just All wanted right. you to know. I don't need this. I wanted you to know. Have All a right. good one. Is that is, is that Brazilian oh, wavy? Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Mari's Barber Salon, where image is everything, located in the heart of Castleton. 8255 Craig Road, Indianapolis, Indiana. Specialize in men, women, and children hair care. Mari's Barber Salon. Professional, family oriented atmosphere. Mari's Barber Salon, where a barber shop is still a barber shop. You have the power to make this decision to quit smoking. It took me to get to a mature age where I understood that if I didn't stop, I was gonna put myself in the same position that my mother was in. And I wanted to make a choice while I still had the chance to be here for my daughter. You can quit. For free help, call 1-800-QUIT-NOW. <laughs> Welcome back. Guess what? You would never guess who stopped by. Never guess. It's an artist on Band Geek Music Group label. Mm, that's one hint. Album out now called The Introduction. That's another hint. Went number four on the Heat Seekers Billboard charts. She's from Gary, Indiana. Boom, boom, boom. What? Don't let that scare you. <laughs> but she lives in Indianapolis and she got a new album coming out. Give it up for the one, the only, Elena Renee. That was the best introduction I've ever had for me. I appreciate that, yes. All right. Hey, what's going on? I'm good, sitting and chilling, having a good time. I'm glad you could stop by. Yes, sir. I know you got a lot of fans in Indianapolis and around <laughs> the world and stuff like that, so you had to make time to come see little old me. Don't say that, no. <laughs> you always show me love, so I couldn't do nothing but show you love back. So. Well, you know I'm going to support you. No well, I appreciate that. You know, um, I just wanted to know, and I know your fans want to know, how long you been singing? Um, without telling my age, I've been singing since I was two. And that's documented. Ooh. That's a fact. Too. So, did you grow up in church singing? Yeah, or? I was born and like I said, born and raised in Gary, Indiana. I live in Indianapolis, singing in the church, and then of, when I got of age, started you know singing in the do joints and whatnot. I like good stuff. A little bit of everything. Okay. So, what, what made you move to Indianapolis? I graduated from Indiana University Bloomington, and then ended up getting a job. I stopped singing for a little bit because I started doubting myself. Then I started meeting people and singing, and it just came back. Stay here. That's mm. it. So what kept you from pursuing like a career and a job and just wanting to really sing and make that your career? Because you have, that's not what I was born to do. 
Mm. Like, you know what you're born to do. And for me, nothing else makes me happy than singing. So that's just it. Mm. So you can do the nine to five and it's nothing wrong with that. But everybody's not made for the nine to five. Hey Amen. You right about I'm that? I'm about a nine to 11, 30. Something <laughs> like that. So. Oh, okay. yeah. I like that. So, you know, with all the music out in the world and everywhere that you grew up, who influences you the most? Anybody that's old school. I like all old school. I'm talking about that good old gutter ground squall kind of music that that Aretha Franklin, Shaka Khan. Uh, Shaka Khan, oh, baby, do it. That's, that's, old, do it. that's, that's baby. actually, that's it right there. That's what um, my mama used to play. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Um, SOS band? Yes. Earth, Wind, and Fire? Yes. Okay. Mavis Staples, the Staples Singers, all of that. Okay. So Nancy Wilson, I love all of that. Okay, I, I know something. A lot of people wanted to know, you know, do you still perform with Toy Factor? I, I used to see you with Toy Factor. I actually sang with them for about seven years and then okay. I stopped because um, they've been together forever. And okay. it was just time for me to get out there and do my own thing. Okay. I wanted to make my own name. I didn't want to be a part of a band. I wanted to be Elena Renee. Oh, because you showed me jamming when we used to come and see well, you. I appreciate that. <laughs> Thank now, you. you know, I do see you singing out a lot. And me as a fan, I want to know, what's your style of music? I am a soul singer. I'm a soul singer. Soul singer. So that's not, that's my style, meaning anything that hits you right here or anything that you can feel, that's the kind of music that I sing. Okay. Now, that's not the only type of music I can sing, so I don't want you to put me in a box, but my thing, I love soul music. I see, it's like timeless. It doesn't go out of style. So. Well, you're right. Because I would think soul, I would think more like Jill Scott when people say soul. Is that or no? You're thinking of like neo soul. Okay, okay. So that's a part of that as well. Soul music is anything that you can feel. Mm. So however you translate that, that's on you. Okay. So that could be some forms of R&B, some forms of hip hop, country, whatever the case may be. So I sing soul music. That's feel good music. Mm. And so however I choose to express it, that's how it comes out. Mm, okay. So, how is music important in your life? It's my IV. It's my lifeline. Mm. It's kind of like air. Like, if I don't have it, I'm done. Okay. So, it kept me from, it kept me out of the streets. It kept me from choking folks out. It kept me from doing all of this <laughs> stuff. Music is, is everything. Uh -huh. Like, it literally set the mood and the vibe for every single thing possible. Mm. So. Okay. Now... I know I see you on the big stages with all the biggest artists, and maybe the world want to know who are some of the people you've performed with. I literally just recently opened for I shared the stage with Brandy, Ooh. Frankie Beverly and Mays, Black Street, Al Green, Jill Scott. Woo! Um, I've shared the stage with Shaka Khan. I've shared you, this. You've met Shaka Khan? Listen. I, I've met them. Like, I've never been, and my favorite is probably Shirley Murdoch. I love so Shirley. So I met her and I was, and Johnny Gill and all of them. So it's just. Ma, 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 ma. No, that's okay. You keep that, okay? Um, you keep that. You know, I can't sing better than you. Put that back in your pocket. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm going to take care of that part. Don't worry about that. So, but yeah, I met uh, Shirley Murdoch. I did a play with her and I was starstruck. Okay. Like, she is everything. And if y'all don't know who Shirley Murdoch is, that's who got her start with uh, Zapp and Roger. Mm. Um, and then she had the hit song, As We Lay, mm. and all that good stuff. Now so, that's back in my grandmother and my mama's generation, right? Well, Shirley? I don't know how old your grandma is, and I don't want to play her like 40, that. She's 40, 50. She's in the late Okay, 50s. yeah. Did she own a record player? Uh-huh. Then that was in her era. Oh, yeah. okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yep. Dang. So, boy, you've done a whole lot. Dang. I've been very blessed and grateful. It's This is new to me. Everything is just, we just starting over. Like I literally am trying to focus and go like to the next level. I've been doing this for a long time, but it's just time for me to go to the next level. Okay. So for everybody who don't know, get in contact, can they follow you? Is it, you have any social media so people can Everything follow you? Everything on social media is Elena Renee. That's A-L-A-I-N-A-R-E-N-A-E. -A -A -E. Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, everything. The album is called The Introduction. It's mm. everywhere. So, and before you get out of here, I know because we got to wrap it up, but um, do you got a play or something like that coming up? I do. Um, it is September 15th and 16th, and I'm actually in it with uh, Lil G from Silk. So we'll be doing that. Ooh. I'm going to put it on my social media, so if you follow me, then you'll be able to see exactly where it is. Oh, so we go. that's going to be crazy. Well, give it up again for Elena Renee. Across the country, 
millions of Americans are being prescribed opioids for pain relief. Sure, opioids mask the pain, but there are risks. Opioid side effects range from nausea to withdrawal symptoms to overdose. Approximately 25% of people prescribed opioids for long-term pain relief struggle with addiction. And those addicted are 40 times more likely to move on to heroin. When it comes to managing your pain, you have a choice. Don't mask your pain with opioids. Choose to treat it with the help of a physical therapist. Physical therapists treat pain through movement and exercise. No warning labels required and you get to actively participate in your care. Choose to improve your health without the risks of opioids. Choose physical therapy. Said I'm a showstopper. Yeah. Come on. Then I'm a showstopper I've been waiting too long, too long for you Don't play a part, a part Tell me, what should I do? Don't wanna stay, don't wanna go You feed me lies and all your promises broke gonna cry. He's not worth my time. I guess this is goodbye, baby. I'm too high. I'm too cold. I won't play the sucker role. All your talk is dead. Time to show. What's the baddest thing? Walking out the door, baby. I'm a showstopper. Baby, I'm a showstopper. If you don't get it together, it's the show is popping. You just gonna have to sit back and watch ya. Baby, I'm a show. I've been waiting alone so long, but you're never home. If it's a game, if so, I ain't playing. No, no, don't wanna stay, don't wanna go. Feed me lies and all your promises, bro. Not gonna cry, he's not worth my time. I guess this is goodbye, baby. I'm too high, I'm too cold. I won't play the sucker role. All your talk is dead, time to show. What's the best thing? Walking out the door, baby. I'm a showstopper, baby. I'm a showstopper. If you don't get it together, if the show is popping, you just gon' have to sit back and watch ya. Baby, I'ma show, I'ma show you how to just appreciate and chance with love. You ain't never had nobody show you what's really made up. Because I'm just too beautiful. To be stressing about you, to be worried about you. So if you ain't worried about me, then you can just watch me leave. Oh, oh. Baby, I'm a showstopper. To go, I won't play. Your sucker roll, all your talk is dead. Time to show. What's the baddest thing? Walking up the door, baby, I'm a showstopper. Baby, I'm a showstopper. If you don't get it together, it's the show that's popping. You just don't have to sit back and watch ya. Baby, I'm a showstopper. Art inspires creativity. And that creativity leads to worlds being built. And lives change. Hi, my name is Greg, and I believe that influencing our community can start with our children. I have written these books to influence our children using story coloring books that will open their minds to all possibilities and lessons of life. So not only are they coloring and flexing their artistic muscles, but they're also learning 
and reading about moral principles that will get them through life. So, to order and to support me in my mission to serve our community, purchase the coloring books at Amazon.com. Pimped out Gucci suit. Ain't got no job. Hey, 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 Stan, do you ever get hungry? Why, yes, I do. And in, in you know fact, I, am. I can eat right now. Well, what you want? A little bit of that chicken teriyaki. Chicken, chicken teriyaki. teriyaki. Chicken teriyaki. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Stan, got it. But, don't, don't bring that up, because we ain't getting no money from none of this stuff. Here you go. Hey, hey, are you talking about the lyrics we wrote for them boys? The, the quadruplets. The, uh, the, no, they called like, the friends. The Amigos. The Amigos. The That's them boys' name. The, I, like, uh, I like that on set, dude. The, I, and I yeah. like queso. Queso good. Queso now, real good. You thought the cheese? The, the boy. <laughs> oh, man. You know what but, I'm Wait, it's one more. Uh, spaceship, spaceship, that's his Whatever name. the boy name is. He, he like always be on They the, all look you know, like Yeah, 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 yeah. But, um, you know, we ain't get nothing from that. Nothing. We said that it was about the music, and now you're making you it You said a... it was about the music. It's about the money to me. You know, I shouldn't be sweeping no broom at no school. I should be buying a school. You know what you, you absolutely, yeah. what you want to do about it? You want to get mad? Hmm? Because, because if you're we so sue. mad, we gonna sue. We're, we're not suing we, nothing. We gonna no, sue. No, we're not gonna sue nothing. All right. We in it for the long haul. We took a vow and all. That. <laughs> all right. Now listen. What we gonna do is we gonna grab these brooms and we gonna sweep just like the song say. We gonna walk it how we talk it. All right. That's what we gonna. Like do. we wrote our destiny. Yeah, that like we just that. walk it like we're talking. Now how that just go? Give me, give if, me if the one. If we sweep two. good, it might be a hit secret. Okay. So. <laughs> Sweet with some swag. Sweet, sweet with some sweet swag. With some swag. Sweet, that ain't gonna get no, that ain't gonna get no bars. We can make that a song. Sweet we with some we swag. can do that. Listen, listen. Huh. We got to walk it like we're talking. Now listen, you hungry I boy? I don't know how you satisfied with this, but I'm hungry, man. Let's go get us some meat. Chicken teriyaki, though. Chicken teriyaki. Chicken teriyaki. Hey, you going, boy? I'll be on out there. Just look. Right, man. Hang the broom up like a chicken teriyaki. Yay, yeah, the boots. With the pimped out Gucci suit. Ain't got no job. Plastic fly. Mari's Barber Salon, where image is everything. Located in the heart of Castleton, 8255 Craig Road, Indianapolis, Indiana. Specialized in men, women, and children hair care. Mari's Barber Salon. Professional, family oriented atmosphere. Mari's Barber Salon, where a barber shop is still a barber shop. In the past 50 years, we've made a lot of progress in smoking prevention. But if we don't do more, one out of every 13 children alive today will die early from smoking. That's 5.6 million precious lives we can save. Together, we can make the next generation tobacco free. <laughs> Father, Father, oh, I just need to talk to you. I need to release all my sins. <laughs> I haven't been faithful to you. <laughs> I cheated again. My wife, she, she spent everything good to me, and I've been a jerk. And I just want you to forgive me for my sins and give me another chance. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, uh, yes, 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 my son, I forgive you. Uh, and also, uh, I fired a guy at my company because he looked better than me. <laughs> he had money and he had better muscles than I did. And just because I was his boss, I fired him. <laughs> and that wasn't right. <laughs> and now I feel bad. <laughs> mm, bad, 
my son. Uh, uh, I just don't know what I'm going to do. I just try to be the best entrepreneur out here, and it just seems like things don't go right for me. I don't know what to do. <laughs> mm. My son, uh, you should repent. Yes. Uh, Call on to the Lord, and, and he doesn't look better than you, I don't think. <laughs> well, I know he really doesn't, but he looked better in his tight shirts than I did. Mm. And, and his feet look better than mine, and I don't know why I'm looking at some guy's feet. I you, just, my, you, you've seen this man with no shoes? <laughs> yes, we had a picnic and he wore open toe sandals. And I looked down and <laughs> I still have fungus on my feet. Uh, my, my, my son, <laughs> listen, listen, son, hey, hey, yeah, hey, yeah, now. Yes. I don't, I don't know why you're on a picnic with this man with no shoes or open toe shoes or whatever, but um, <laughs> what I think you should do is, first of all, stop, stop crying. Okay. Okay? Yes. And, um, you know, just, just, just live your life and, uh, um, pray. Definitely pray. Yes. Okay? Yes. Now go ahead, because I got some other people that need help, okay? Yes, Father. It's not just you. Yes, mother. You understand me? Yes, father. Okay. Yes. Mother. Thank you. My son Aiden has asthma. Secondhand smoke has triggered his asthma so bad to the point where he had to end up in the emergency room. And he has spent multiple nights in intensive care. Now he's on a whole bunch of medications. My tip to you is. Don't be shy to tell people not to smoke around your kids. For free help, call 1-800-QUIT-NOW. Welcome back. Hey, that was a good show. Hey, I like to just thank everybody for staying up late with me and, you know, thank the guests for coming out and everything. And right now, we just want to leave you an inspirational word of thought or just a little encouragement. So hit them, Dev. Well, I'm Devin Carey, and pretty much you can be yourself and start a movement. That's a fact. My name is Dre, the actor, man. I want to thank y'all for staying up with us. Um, a quote from Michael Jordan, I can accept failure, but I can't accept not trying. Y'all remember that? Hey, you can't fit in and, and stand out at the same time. So whatever you trying to do, do it. Don't listen to nobody else. I'm Shandria Fene, and I always remember to keep God at the head of your life. Always remember that you're enough. Well, you been up late with G. Williams, so, you know, being up late with us, I hope you appreciate it. We'll see you next time. Good night. Peace. Up late, up late with G. Williams. Up late, up late with G. Williams. He's smart, he's cool, he's funny. He's smart, he's cool, he's funny. Funny, laughter. One way to the heart, laughter. One way to the heart, I said laughter. One way to the heart. <laughs> Up late, up late, up late, up late.